want to do a quick overview of the pop sport tandem bicycle we just got off of ebay um i'll start up front and go over it the shimano combo shifter deals which they seem to work pretty well i've got them on a few bikes and never had a problem um on the listing, it says it has a suspension front fork, which I found odd because all the pictures showed just a standard fork. And it has just a standard fork. The head tube appears to be an inch and an eighth tube that they've put a adapter in to go down to a one inch threaded. So I'm gonna probably switch that out see how it goes um moving on back our seats are actually pretty comfortable see how they hold up but uh both of us agreed last night that they were not bad disc brakes that worked pretty well the uh the drivetrain is awful generic sun run sun run something i don't know it's pretty awful does not shift well tried to adjust it probably going to replace all of that um gotta pick up a thousand watt hub motor to put in the rear so we'll be getting converted to an e-bike and that's what it was bought for the riding experience wasn't bad. I don't know if we were getting a little bit of uh, tail wag when I was riding it or my stoker is a little wiggly. I'm not sure which, but it was a little waggy. I don't know if that's the frame or what. I'm going to have to ride it probably on my own and see or have somebody else ride in the back that's a little more stable. Uh, I didn't see any reviews on this thing anywhere. One of the main reasons I went with this bike is the rear standover is so low, and I got a five-year-old. And I'm thinking with the seat all the way down, he's going to be able to ride and pedal this bike, which would be pretty cool. Find out tomorrow how that works out when he gets back home. 26-inch tires. Tires seem okay. Not bad. Double wall rims. I don't know, no real complaints yet. Do not plan on putting a lot of money in it, just gonna ride it. I have a specialized hard rock in the basement that I will probably steal the drivetrain off of and put on this. Speaking of a hard rock, there's one sitting there to get a little frame size comparison. I believe that is a medium and this is probably a little bit smaller it is a small frame if you're taller i would say forget about it because it's gonna be rough all right that's the first review of it i gotta go do some grocery shopping take the rad wagon back out for that and i'll probably post an update when we get the motor on there and get that all figured out. All right, have a good day.